Real women murders, not fiction. Love women, don't kill them. Giving real women, unknown women, recognition to the world. Please support our channel and please, please subscribe. News on Sixes, Kristen Weaver tells us Dr. Jack Janway's friends and patients are shocked by this news. Friends of the Janways say they were well known and loved by many in the community and by the patients at Dr. Janway's chiropractic office, and they are devastated by what happened. People who knew Dr. Jack Janway say he was more than a talented chiropractor. He was a friend with a kind soul who cared about his patients. Everyone I know has had nothing but positive things to say. It's such a loss. They knew him. Their kids have known him. Their grandkids have known him. Muskogee Mayor Marlon Coleman was one of Dr. Janway's patients and started seeing him after a car accident a few years ago. He says Jack was a staple in his community. Well, it's one of those uh, cultural communities shocks that has gone out because of the impact that he's had uh, professionally and personally. Carolyn Keeling went to Dr. Jack for many years and stopped by the office today, which was closed. He's always been such a dear, dear Christian man and friend. It's probably been 15 years I've been coming to him. He had a God-given talent and we will miss him so much. Carolyn says Dr. Jack healed her pain and was there for her whenever she needed it. Muskogee police say Jack's wife, Terry, shot and killed Jack and their 11-year-old grandson, Dalton, who lived with them. Dalton was a fifth grader at the Sadler Arts Academy. He loved little Dalton. He was his buddy. Terry was the mother-in-law of NASCAR driver Jimmy Johnson, who is married to Jack and Terry's daughter, Chandra. Muskogee Schools has counseling services set up up through Green Country Behavioral Health for those who knew Dalton. In Muskogee, Kristen Weaver, Oklahoma Zone, News on 6. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.